Good afternoon. This is Deke with South Alabama Paranormal Research Team. This is our recording from the old power dam that we filmed a few weeks ago. I do apologize for the delay in, in getting this up. Uh, we've been battling some sickness and some other things that we've had to get rid of. And last night we had a house cleansing here in our personal property. And now that seemed to have worked. There's a, It's a lot lighter here. The moods have changed here. So if y'all ever need something like that done, please notify us, and we'll be glad to come out and investigate, and if need be, uh, do a cleansing for you. Uh, this is South Alabama Paranormal Research Team. We're at the Old Power Dam. I have started recording previously before getting out here to our location spot. We are currently on the back side of the power dam that opens up where the huge turbines used to be at. Since we've been out here, we've heard... It sounded like something walking up behind us, but we are the only people out here. Okay, we are, as I said, on the back side of the dam. That used to be where the huge turbines used to be. Now, I don't know... As far as history-wise, if there's been any reported deaths here, but, you know, a hundred years of being here, I'm pretty sure. But as you can see, you still see the ring down there where the turban piece would sit in the water. Oh, I just have to pause it for a minute. That little hair right there is just cracking me up watching it move with the speaker. I don't know if you'll find that fascinating or not, but I just find it funny. Is there somebody in here with us? You can come talk to me in a device in my left hand. You know, it's my wife. Yes, I have my wife and kids here with us today. I don't know if y'all saw it on the other side, but the old ladder is still there. Matter of fact, there you go, right there. The old ladder, to come, if you want a chance at climbing up there. Me personally, I'll climb up the back side. Done it thousands of times. But you can see this would be filled with water. This is one of my favorite places to come to because not too many people come out here. It's quiet. But like I said, I have had experiences in my own out here being by myself. Okay, my wife's indicating to me she's scared to talk on camera that something just pulled her hair. I'm going to set the recorder. Actually, I'm going to hold on to my digital recorder and scroll down. Brought my K2 in. If you're out here, can you come touch the device in my left hand, make it light up? Got a mosquito on your face. Come touch it. If you touch it, I don't know if it'll do it. It'll, it'll light up like that. And I don't think my phone did that. Because usually the phone you know, stays constant. This one hit orange and then backed off. What is your name? Uh, I want it to be known, there is no electricity, no power lines, anywhere out here. By the way, on the other side of that sandbar right there, it's right in Hatch River. Can you come in and device my hand light up again? Who pulled my wife's hair? Can you make it light to orange? If you're in the woods, come over here and talk to us. 
I hear you walking around. Alright, I'm going to set this device right here so you can touch it as you wish. Let's go with you. Alright, I'm going to try this app. I've used it a couple times and I've had some pretty good success with it. Other ghost hunters that we know have also used it. Some that we watch on a daily basis like Omar Gosh and Hun, uh, Hunting the Dead. If you haven't checked those guys out yet, check them out. They're actually interesting. They go to, to some pretty creepy places. Is there someone out here with us? What are we supposed to stay away from? Can you tell me my name? I thought this is so beautiful over here. Am I supposed to stay away from the edge right here? Look at that view. Y'all can see why I love coming out here, just the, the beauty. How many spirits is out here with us? Now, I'm sure you've noticed that you can come talk to the device in my right hand through this, this app. Keep it on the screen for me. Has anybody died where the turbine used to be at? Tell me your name. Are you on this side? Walk inside that that area and then walk over here. There's plastic of cold right there. I want it to be known that it's probably between 58 and 63 degrees right here where I'm at right now and it's been in the 80s all day there's something evil here at the power dam are you following me yep what? Is someone trying to communicate with my wife? What's your name? If you're here, can you make your presence known? Make a noise. Knock on something. Shake a tree. Move a leaf. Get back this way. Go touch the K2, make the K2 light up. Must have got really quiet once we walked out here. 
Do you like it whenever I'm inside the tunnel here talking to you? Uh, are you in the left tunnel or the right tunnel? On the left. All right. Can you make a noise for me? I'm not here at the water. Can you make the water splash? Give me a name. What is my daughter's name that's with me? Playing in the sand. Did you hear that? Say it again. My wife didn't hear it. It was drawn out slowly. Can you tell me my name? We're going to see if this will stay running in the background. I'm going to pull up another app I want to try. Yeah. This is our thermal camera app. And yes, I know it's just you know, for gimmicks, but you'd be surprised at what you can catch. Can you come manifest yourself in front of my camera? Must be the sun coming in right there, so I'll do that. Well, that'd be nice, it's just paint there. It's not a portal. <laughs> yeah, that was like a portal. On the screen here. Manifest, uh, manifest yourself for me. Let me see. Now this particular app, you know it says thermal camera, it deals with light. The lighter something is, the darker will it be. Like for instance, you see here the, the white and red, or the yellow, orange and red. That's sand. So, in theory, if something was to walk across your camera, it would either be really bright like that, or it would be just simply just something like a mass walking by. You scared to show yourself? We don't mean you any disrespect. How many people have died here? Can you make the K2 light up? I'm giving you plenty. Thank you. Do it again because I wasn't quite looking at it. Whoa, big hit. Big hit. Thank you. Can you do that again? All right, now, so. So you've seen I'm away from it. And this camera is way, this phone's way over here. What's your name? Can you make it light to red? Can you light it all the way up again?
What am I to listen for? Yep. Do you like the lights? Do you remember me from the, I used to come here as a kid? If you remember me, make a light to yellow. Make a light up again. Make a light to yellow. That's green. One more. Use the energy around us. There's plenty of battery life and a bunch of ice is in my hands. You don't have to be scared of us. We're not here to cause you any harm. Here's just trying to learn. Do you know what year you died in? No. You know, you go. Now, I assume that flowing water like this will help strengthen spirits to help communicate. I'm going to leave this one, and we're going to get the dowsing rods, if you will. Right. Get over here so that can go to Alright. Alright, now we're going to cross for yes, open for no. Did you die on this property? Cross for yes, open for no. You can do it. Cross for yes, open for no. Straight. Boom. Good shot. That was actual gunshots. We heard it more than once while we was out there. Alright, you know what? We uh, are no longer feeling safe at this location. So we're going to go ahead and wrap this up. Just like I said earlier. Going to somewhere like this. I leave it a little cleaner. You know, this is our earth. We have to care and protect it. But this is deep with South Alabama Paranormal Research Team. Just remember the hot's just right around the corner. Alright. So if you've heard anything and like to share, please comment with a timestamp. And I love interaction from from people that watches our stuff. That's why we do it. But Till next time, just remember the haunt's just right around the corner.